Hey everyone, I'm Alfred. Welcome back to Mermaid Swamp. Last time I got scared for the first time in a year or so. And hey, it's time to crack open this engine key and boat our way over the swamp. The Mermaid Swamp. Don't aim at that boat or anything, guys. Wouldn't want you to strain yourselves. Yep. Boats, as you know, are just a form of teleportation. Rock.jpg. The ground here is weird. It makes a weird sound when you step on it. Ugh. Oh, here we go. A grate? Looks like I can remove it and go down. I see a rope ladder. I guess I'll go in. Never good to see a rope ladder in an area like this. It's very gooey. It's dark. Oh, yeah, the lighter. Ah, I feel very welcome here. I was reminded of a very good um, pro tip for any sort of scary situation you may find yourself in. Imagine you are Steve Irwin examining a bunch of cool creatures. Cold, my body's freezing. Ah, here we go. Not again. I guess the curse can only work on one person at a time. The hell is up ahead? But I imagine it may also help to pretend that you are Shane Madey, unimpressed thoroughly by all manner of ghosties and uh, just memeing your way through there. All right. Come on. Power through it, Rin. Dynamite. Detonator. Rock. Um, what the fuck? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, as I suspected. Monster! The hell? This is this the mermaid from the mermaid legend? How disgusting. I gotta get out of here. No, take it. Bottle of liquid. Five large fish tanks. Something's inside each. Okay, so wife, daughter, other daughter. Original mermaid. Eh? Huh? We haven't been back to Yuka's room. It just occurred to me. We haven't been inside Yuka's room since we saw her. Mm hmm. What open? Hey, what the? How to get locked? Well, the shadow men, of course. Is somebody there? Hey, you are, aren't you? Open it, please. Hey, open up. Let me out of here. Open this goddamn fuck damn shit damn zog damn 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 motherfucking door. Let me out of here. Open. Open. Get the axe. Um, what? Okay, so she's just screaming. How many days has it been? I've totally lost track of time. You have a watch. Why am I still alive when all my friends are dead? If I'm going to die, I just want it over with. She's upside down. I'm so hungry. I want that beef on rice. I want meat. No, honey. Meat. 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 Okay, cool. It was just a dream. You're still alive? Yeah, I was having a weird dream. You know, like one of those marshmallow dreams when you eat a marshmallow and then your pillow's gone? Oh my word. You ate the poor th the poor mermaid's flesh? Dude, what do you think? 
ate the mermaid meat. I mean, for a real mermaid, the lower half is at least edible, right? Without being cannibalism. <laughs> no one will believe you as sane as you are. I've gotten the bad ending, haven't I? Are you familiar with this story? It's about a certain nun. A beautiful girl, 17. She ate the flesh of a mermaid found by her village and became immortal. After 800 years, she finally perished, but even her death is not a certainty. Perhaps she still lives somewhere. How will you fare, I wonder? Eight the mermaid. Eight the mermaid. Meat. Of course, of this, this is just a weird, bloated human. I won't die. Won't die. Won't die. It's a very ironic fate for somebody whose friends have all just died. Now you're stuck alive. Ha <laughs> ha. Shut up. Yaobi Kuni. Fuck you. All right. Time to crack open this fucking guide. Do boo 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 boo. -boo. Okay. If you accept what's his face, you just die. Okay, yeah, so I got the worst possible ending. Okay. Whoops, that's the wrong button. Let me just open that again. Thank you. Wait. All right, yes, let me just open that again. Thank you very much. Resume. Start from here, I think. All right, I don't know where the sub key is. Is it this one? Hey, well, randomly hitting buttons, I uh, accidentally uh, stopped the fucking recording. Whoops. All right, back to here. And now we'll hit don't dodge. Nowhere to run, nowhere to hide. <laughs> she just punches him? Why was that not informed to me as a valid option? Ha! Get a grip and stop being so damn full of yourself. Be by your side, you're a flat out creep. Who wanna sleep with Mr. Gray here? Certainly ain't me. Hear me? Don't you ever try anything this stupid again. You mook. Sadero. It's Sadero. Ah, oh, crap, he's passed out. Gah. Sandra. Ow, my stomach. What the hell did you... <laughs> the hell, Ramazaki? <laughs> Shut up, Baldy. I'm the one with the Helen. Don't go attacking me out of the blue, you goddamn poivot. I'm gonna have to go after a monkey like you. Are you that self-conscious? Say what? You saying I'm lying? No, hold on. I think my headache couldn't keep getting kept getting worse. I couldn't think anymore, and then I was an axe. Yeah, I was carrying this, and I tried to. You remember? You were conscious when you were chasing me. Well, I was, but I couldn't stop what I was doing. Body was moving on its own, I guess. It's 
the mermaid. Mermaid's curse screwed you up. Same as it did Yuda. Still going on about this? There is no damn curse. You literally got mind control, dog! <sighs> I don't know what I saw. It could have been anything. Fucking X-Files, man. Oh, really? Ain't possible to curse, huh? And you saying you attack me sane? Hug me tight sane? All that come your stuff. You said that sane? Oh, well. I'm so scared. I want to be by your side, Rin, my dear. Oh, is that was in your right mind? Because that means you stop. All right, it's a curse. Because I'd never be attracted to a bumpkin like you unless there was a curse behind it. Um, fuck you. For Christ's sakes, that's his reason? I want to start believing in curses, but given what happened to Yuka and Yuta, it might be a chance that it's true. Have I been trying to say that? It's all the fault of the curse. We got to do something about it or we'll never get away. Have a plan for what doing something entails? Hell no. Just got to hope for a lead and search our asses off. All right, I'll help. Maybe I'll read up on the mermaid legend. If it's a legend, there might be books about it. I'll be checking up on it in the study. You look around the mansion of the swamp. Come ask me about anything. I noticed that that axe model got, or I guess not a model, but picture got reused. What a dickhead. Oh, yeah, and then I guess we just go find him here in the study no matter what. Or earlier he'd be in the room next to it. Got something to ask? About this mermaid legend, what do you think? You figure anything out? What's this all of a sudden? Hey, you got a good head if nothing else, so I figured you might make something of it. You're getting more on my nerves by the minute. Mermaid legend. Well, it's weird. A mermaid in the mountains... And there's a lot of weird bits to it. Weird bits. Legends like this are usually made to either bring people in or keep people away, generally speaking. Like couples uh, who come to this lake stay together forever. Kappa live in this lake, so stay away. The former brings people, the latter repels them. In the mermaid legend, clearly it's a keeper away or -er. The part about curses tells you it's dangerous. Yeah, and what about all of that? What are they keeping people away from? Yeah. People wouldn't really come here in the first place. There's a village, but not really people. So why would you make a legend to keep people away? You don't want to swim in the swamp? Why make a story about a man stealing a mermaid and getting cursed? Just saying Kappa would do fine. Or Pog Champ, even. And there's even more that's off. Because of the kidnapped mermaid's curse, girls vanish from the nearby village. That's what the legend wars. Why would girls vanish? If the mermaid had a grudge, wouldn't it be against the men of the family, the Suchitas? Why have a, curse, a curse on unrelated village girls? You got a point. It's clearly been fabricated for something, but what's such an utterly fake legend before? That's what I want to know. I went to the boiler room and I found this power generator thing. Power generator in the boiler room? Why does this household have a boiler room? Hell if I know. Water heater and plumbing and all this other mess? Wonder well, what that's all for. Plumbing. Well, that's curious. I'll have to check that later. Interesting. So I guess the golden ending is if they all live. There's probably another ending where only uh, uh, Seitaro, Seitaro dies. Weird. So there's probably four endings total besides the bad ends you get from dying. Uh, strange. Well, now I'm kind of at a loss of what to do. Can I save over this because I already have the video of it? Um, hmm. Yeah, I'm. I'm not really sure how to progress here. A little strange. Also, why was there one down here? I suppose there could be more than five because of all the weird goop that's been happening. And I mentioned earlier that of the five mermaids, one of them was probably the original, one was his wife, and one was... Uh, two were the daughters. And then one might be new, but honestly, I have no claim upon that. I'm just spitballing here. Um... I was sort of right about bog bodies as well. Books. The axe. Oh, maybe I can use the boat key.
Oh, there we go. Hey, Sator, you got a compass or something? Why? Around this map of the swamp area. I want to go to the red mark, but I don't know the orientation. I see. Borrow this. Watch, what the hell for? Uh, same deal. I gotcha. Thanks. Useful. I wonder if it can be done here. No. Yana yana. Boat. Oh, we're going to go across the swamp just like last time, and when we get locked in, Sadero is going to show up. No, oh, or he comes with us. Rin, what is it? Going in the spot on the map, right? I'm coming with you. Wouldn't want you taking a dive again. Ah, shut up, Baldy. Why is he calling him that? He's not bald. He very clearly has a full head of hair. It's gray, but this is also, like, kind of anime. So who fucking knows? Oh, great. Looks like we can remove it. I see something below. Looks like there's a ladder going down. Hey, Rin, where's the lantern I gave you? Oops, sorry, wrong voice. I broke it a while back. Screw you two. Um, fuck you? Hold that and follow me, all right? What's up? Cold, I got so cold all of a sudden. I'm freezing here. Oh, so is this when the curse would start to affect her? Except for then she ate mermaid flesh and got immune to it, but got a different curse. Where well, that should help a little. Let's go. Yeah, thanks loads. These two are in love, right? Like, hello? Monster. It's not a monster. This is... Is that it then? The mermaid legend is... And this must be... Sator, are these mermaids? I suppose they're mermaids, yeah, but... Make up your mind. Are they mermaids or are they not? Yes, they're mermaids. Like the one the legend speaks of without a doubt. I see. <laughs> what are you doing? Stay back, Sandro. I'm going to smash him. Stop it. What's that going to accomplish? It's not going to accomplish anything, I know. But I can't let this crap stand. They killed Yuka and Yuta. Also, I would imagine that this is something of a mercy kill, right? It's their fault Yuka and Yuta died. They were murdered. Those things killed them. You think this is funny? What we ever do to you? Didn't do nothing to them, did we? Give them back. Give back Yuka and Yuta. I'll make you give them back. This is probably the bad side that ends up leading to... Yeah, because if it was a good ending, then they would be alive. Give them back, please. I want them back. Win. Last little bit of voice acting, huh? Yeah, I guess the voice acting only shows up here. I'm getting chills on my neck. Boo! Scare me, come on. Stop teasing me. Oh, of course. Crap, not again. Wherever I walk, it's always back here. Oh, I guess we just got out. Damn it. One more time, my favorite Daft Punk song. Stop it, Sato, this is pointless. We just can't get away from here. We don't know that yet. If we keep walking, we'll learn the land. And Suchita might come back. It's no use. You said it yourself. It's not possible without a map. Three whole days we got nowhere. We've been locked in this place by those mermaids. 
I think the mermaids are more victims than you realize, but I suppose that would be something that we figured out on the other ending. You know, Ophelia... Fucking jeez. Oh, sorry. I thought he was calling me Ophelia. I didn't read the name. You know, Ophelia? The Ophelia paintings are so pretty. She's down in the water. It looks so beautiful. Must be why she gets painted so much. Or, artists are full of shit. Like, oh, I'm being shot in the chest, but my makeup is still perfect. Whatever. I wonder if it hurts or not to die in the water like that. Um, apparently drowning is the most awful way to die you could possibly ever die. Possibly even worse than starving to death. Who knows? If I'm gonna die, that'd be nice. In the water without suffering, staying beautiful. It's not... Devoid of suffering. You're right. I'd go the same way. You guys are idiots. Oh dear God. Uh-huh. And then it's just going to kick me back to the... Yep, there you go. Uh, wow. Uh-huh. Okay. Actually, was four the one? It was, yeah. So if I just go back to bed here. Or maybe I go talk to him. How do I not light the fire? If you take the firewood, you'll be forced to... Damn it. On the other hand, I could just say, well, I fucked up and got a bad ending. Of course, I have no idea where this is. I mean, yeah, I could just say I got a bad ending and call it there. Especially because I have no clue where my fucking... Where this is. Neat. Just music, scene illustrations. And then these presumably are the other endings. All right, what does that say at the bottom? Illustrations from unseen ending routes are not shown. Makes sense. Bonus illustration. You need more. Wow. Um. Tja, wow. Uh, that's Mermaid Swamp then, huh? Really, really solid game. Not at all what I really expected from it. Um, this might not be the last episode. I might be convinced to play it again and get the good ending. Um, I do kind of want to convince more people to play this game themselves because that's kind of the nature of Let's Playing. But also, uh, you know, could just kind of, you know, might be cool to just... See the endings. And if I'm going to play it, I might as well show it. So, uh, no matter what happens, I'm still going to do more spooky videos for Halloween. But until then, I've been Alfred. This has been Mermaid Swamp, possibly the last episode. Um, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day, everyone. Happy Halloween.